Alright, let's look at the difference in solubility between carboxylic acids and their ions and why the ions are more soluble in water than the acid. If we look at the carboxylic acid group, we can label the polarity. Okay. Alright, so we've got some partial charges. Um, the OH group is, is polar. CO group is polar due to the differences in electronegativity, remember that. Now, we can have hydrogen bonding. Which is a secondary interaction between water molecules and the carboxylic acid. Like this. Okay, due to the polar nature of water. Now this is fine for carboxylic acids with a low molar mass, but uh, the, the longer the non-polar carbon chain on the carboxylic acid, uh, the less soluble it is. Okay, so carboxylic acids slightly soluble in water depending on the length of the carbon chain due to the hydrogen interactions that can occur between uh, the carboxyl group and water molecules okay so let's have a look at the difference with the carboxylate ion and why that is soluble so may as well just leave a water molecule there I'll just put that there. Okay, now, let's put the carboxylate ion. We've got this negative charge here. Okay, water. Let's get some partial charges going here. Okay, now the carboxylate ion is able to form what's called an ion dipole reaction uh, interaction with with partial positive charges on the water molecule. Okay, this is called ion dipole interaction. Now these interactions are stronger than hydrogen interactions. Therefore, more soluble. Okay, so this is the carboxylate ion. Okay, so in summary, the carboxylate ion is more soluble in water than the carboxyl group due to the fact that it can undergo ion dipole interactions with water molecules. Okay, due to the full negative charge on this uh, oxygen here. Um, ion dipole interactions are stronger than hydrogen interactions, therefore, that accounts for the difference in solubility between the carboxylate ion and the carboxylic acid.